the connective tissue between Hannah Gutierrez Reed and Alec Baldwin is, as the judge said in Hannah's sentencing, an utter lack of remorse, an utter lack of taking any accountability. And as we have seen since this tragic incident, Alec Baldwin, for moment one, has expressed sympathy for only himself. Along with his wife, who keeps posting shots of herself in skin-tight leggings and stiletto heels walking around New York and very callously posting happy moments of them with their family as the family of Helena Hutchins goes without a wife and mom. Guys, it didn't help anything when the co-defendant, the armorer, and armorer is the person on the set that's in charge of all of the ammo and the guns and the weapons. Hannah Gutierrez Reed actually is caught calling the jurors idiot a-holes. Idiots and a-holes. Okay. That's not going to help anything. Uh, again, with me, an all-star panel, but now I want to go to Dale Carson. And remember, panel, we're not having high tea at Windsor Castle. Just jump in if you have a thought. Dale Carson, high-profile lawyer, former FBI agent, joining us out of Jacksonville, star, uh, ho uh, author of Arrest Proof Yourself. He's at DaleCarsonLaw.com. Dale, have your clients still not figured out their calls are being recorded? You know, when you've got it's somebody real... two or three days before sentencing and they're going, the jury's an a-hole, the jury's a bunch of idiots. Really? It's, it's, a, it's a real problem. And no matter how many times you tell your clients that they're recording the phone calls, it really doesn't have a, a significant effect on their conversations on telephones to their friends because they're talking to people that they purportedly or have positive relationships with. And of course, she's probably right. They did convict her, although they did find her not guilty of the Put cocaine up, charge, which is kind of a gift. Up. Put him up. Did you just say Gutierrez is kind of right? Is that what you said? She's probably I did. Right. Was she no, no, the absolutely I did. They, from her perspective, they convicted her, right? They're not oh, friends. Is that of hers, her truth? Obviously. Is she just telling her truth? In other words, <laughs> of course. history rewritten the way she wants it to be? Well, I, they convicted her, and you got to know that that doesn't make her feel good. So since she's full of herself, she's going to say she that feels, it's their are you fault. Crazy? What? I just. Are, are you okay, number one? Are you in the middle of like maybe. Okay, so you're agreeing with the woman that a jury has found guilty in a homicide charge where a shooting death occurred at the workplace of a young wife slash mother, incredible cinematographer. You're okay with her calling the jurors a-holes and idiots. I'm a defense attorney, Nancy. Of course I'm okay with that. I zealously well, represent my Well, you know what's interesting? Client. A snake crawls on its belly and it thinks it's a king, okay? But it's not. It's a snake. So blurting out, I'm a defense attorney, doesn't make it okay. You know what? I'm going to let you think about what you've done for a few moments. I'm putting you in the corner. You're in official timeout. <laughs> uh, guys, right. in case any of you have forgotten what this is about, all right, we're joking around. Helena Hutchins is dead. She has a little boy and a husband. The little boy, no mommy. No mommy. That's never going to change for him. There may be a stepmother someday. There may be a daddy's girlfriend. But there is no such thing as a new mother. Take a listen to this 911 call. A Bonanza Creek Ranch has had two people accidentally shot on a movie set by a prop gun. We need help immediately. Okay. Bonanza Creek Ranch, come on. Stay, stay on the phone with me. We're going to get some help, okay? Okay. What is your name? Don't hang up, okay? Hold on just one second. It sounds like somebody else is calling for two ambulances. Else is calling you better make sure. Good. Everybody should be. We need some help. Our director and our cameraman, our camera woman has been shot. Are they going to take him to the road? So was it loaded with a real bullet or one? I, don't, I cannot tell you that. Okay. 